Hey guys, today I will walk through you easy panel, a free C panel alternative. If you're familiar with C panel, it's a web hosting control panel, but it's not free. Uh, easy panel is free and has paid versions. Uh, but today, uh, let, let me show you the interface of easy panel. So I have installed Easy Panel in Contrabo Cloud VPS, and so far uh, it's a really good control panel. But I think Easy Panel is great for uh, hosting web applications, and that's it. And for more con um, customizable aspect. It lacks uh, like security uh, configurations, email, and uh, multi-user support for free version. But if you want to have a control panel that is straightforward, you can easily install web applications such as WordPress. Uh, Easy Panel is a go-to uh, control panel. So I am here in my uh, easy panel dashboard and you can see here this is the basic um, monitoring. So I have C CPU under 1.5% and by the way easy panel is uh, easy to install and it's very lightweight. Uh, if you want to change the theme there is the dark mode here and you can just Click this for light mode and let's go to settings. This is what you will see. So the logs, the tray thick and the docker. You can prune images here and you can use your own custom domain to access um, easy panel. So this is the default domain, but I prefer to have a custom domain. So that's it. So the security is just uh, two factor authentication. There is no option for whitelisting and blacklisting IP addresses. And you can also have your uh, GitHub token here and license. And for users, backups, and clusters, you need paid license for this. So let's go back to our dashboard. Uh, here you can just create uh, projects easily. You can name this project first uh, project. So let's create. And if you want to uh, have a, um, a database service, you can choose uh, five uh, MySQL and MariaDB as well as Postgres, MongoDB, and Redis. And if you want to install an application, you can go to templates and select which web application you want to install. For instance, the popular one is WordPress. You can uh, create WordPress with just one click. You can choose uh, either MySQL or MariaDB. And just click right here. Let's go to project. And if you want to change the domain, go to domains. You can add your domain here. And this is a, a temporary uh, subdomain. You can just open it. And here you can install your uh, WordPress. So if you don't have, I or if you don't know how to install WordPress in this panel, I, I made um, a video for that. I will put it on the description down below. And you can also add basic authentication. And you can also add redirects for your WordPress. So here you can uh, click advanced can uh, change the uh, mount 
and and you can limit your resources so that it, in case your WordPress will consume more than the allowed um, resources so you can just set it here and you can also create a replica so I uh, suggest you can you should, uh, you can you should create one because it's actually a staging, staging environment and you can also stop uh, your web applications by clicking this one and you, if there is something wrong you can just of course rebuild this one and the console here and if you want to delete this one you can just click destroy here and that is so for its features the, um, when creating a WordPress so if you want to add more applications, say for example, you can create your own, for instance, help desk. You can uh, choose free scout. You can just uh, click it, click create, leave this as is, and be sure to uh, secure your email and password. Just be great here. Let's go to back to project and your VSCOUT app will be instantly created as slow as well as your uh, MySQL. And you can wait it uh, for the process to finish. This is color yellow. We'll wait you can wait for it to turn to green. And that's it. It's uh, so that's it. Uh, the yellow turns uh, green right now. I uh, can just click open, and under the domains, you can just need to add your domain. So okay, let's just refresh here because that's green. Yeah, okay, that is free scout. So that's it. This is so far the features of Easy Panel. It's a straightforward uh, control panel. It's very simple. And if you have um smaller size uh, BPS, uh, you can choose Easy Panel. Uh, and if you have a bigger one, uh, you can add more projects. So this is uh, this version. Uh, the free version is actually has uh, unlimited projects and uh, unlimited applications as long as you have uh, sufficient uh, resources. So I have installed Easy Panel in Contabo Cloud VPS, and so far it uh, it runs smooth and it's great, uh, straightforward uh, control panel. So thank you all for watching and I hope you like this video if this video helps you. And please like and subscribe to my channel and I will see you on my next video. Bye for now.